Marriage is a big step, a covenant, a promise, to always be faithful, kind, and supportive, no matter the situation. It can only work if both partners promise to always protect one another, always listen, and always love each other in an unconditional manner. It is important that Katie and Mike always share with each other and listen openly and without fear, trusting that together they will find the right path when they are unsure of the way. It is into this state that the two of them wish to enter. Life is given to each of us as individuals, and yet we must learn to live together. Love is given to us by our family and by our friends. We learn to love by being loved. Learning to love and living together is one of the greatest challenges of life and is the shared goal of married life. Marriage is a supreme sharing of experience and an adventure in the most intimate of human relationships. It is the joyous union of two people whose friendship and mutual understanding have flowered into romance. Today, Mike and Katie proclaim their love and commitment to the world, and we gather here to rejoice with them and for them in this new life they undertake together. Marriage is to belong to each other through unique and diverse collaboration, like two threads crossing in different directions, yet weaving a beautiful tapestry together. The secret of love in marriage is the emergence of the larger self. It is finding one's life by losing it. Such is the privilege of husband and of wife. To be each himself, herself, and yet another. To face the world strong with the courage of two. To make this relationship work, therefore, it takes more than love. It takes trust. Trust to know in your hearts that you only want the best for each other. It takes dedication to stay open to one another, to learn and grow even when it's difficult to do so. And it takes faith, faith to go forward together without knowing what the future holds for the both of you. While love is our natural state of being, these other qualities are not a destination, but they're a journey. By the virtue of the authority vested in me, under the laws of our beautiful state of Florida, I now have the wonderful privilege to pronounce you husband and wife together. Mike, you may kiss your beautiful bride.
for those of you that don't know me, I'm Lindsay, Katie's matron of honor and also the sister of the groom. Katie and I met in high school where we shared the same skill of trying to see who could leave seventh period early. Katie's excuse was that she had to get to work and mine was that I needed to go take a nap. Katie was one of those people that you meet in life and you know you have a lifelong friend in them. She even changed my life by introducing me to Harry Potter. <laughs> Katie, I'm so happy that I can now officially call you my sister. Ron Swanson said it best, you are a wonderful person, your friendship means a lot to me, and you look very beautiful. Katie, you have made my brother the best version of himself, and he is very lucky to have found a life partner in you. I couldn't think of a better person for my brother to spend the rest of his life with. <laughs> I wish you both a lifetime of happiness, and I cannot wait to see what the future holds for you. Katie and I have always joked that she celebrates Lindsay Howley life events better than I did. Well, Katie, this is officially your first Katie Halley Life event, and I don't think it could be any more perfect. Now, if everyone could <laughs> join me in raising their glass and congratulating the very beautiful bride and the handsome groom on a lifetime of happiness. With all of us sitting here today, Mike and Katie have touched our hearts in some way, shape, or form. This day has been a long time coming, and I would never have thought I would be standing here today as Mike's best man, especially after the first time I met Mike. I just started dating my wife, Lindsay, who was also Mike's sister. I was 18 at a pool hall in an extra large Jordan t-shirt <laughs> with my buddies. I don't know who let us in. Here comes Mike. Extra large white tee <laughs> with his buddies. I don't know who let them in. First thing I thought of was, oh crap. Hopefully this guy does not want to fight me. But to my surprise, my girlfriend's brother came up to me, biggest smile on his face, and we exchanged pleasantries. From that point, Mike, Mike immediately welcomed me into his family, and I welcomed him into my family. Katie, you're lucky to have Mike. I know he will always make you a better individual, even if it's as simple as watching Jeopardy while he keeps score on his spreadsheets. <laughs> I know I speak for everyone here when I say we love you both and congratulations. So everyone please raise your glasses to Mr. and Mrs. Halley. <laughs> 